Setting up the AGLC referencing style in EndNote is a three-step process. This tutorial will show you how to set up labels for your references so that your bibliography will be automatically divided into sections according to the AGLC referencing style. In EndNote, click on Tools, then Define Term Lists. In the Term Lists pop-up box from the Lists tab, click on Create List. Type Label into the new Term List name field and then click OK. Click on Link Lists. Scroll down to the Label field. Click on the drop down arrow and change None to Label. Click OK. Click the Terms tab. You have to create five terms. Click on New Term. Type A Articles, Books, Reports. Then click on Save Term. Overwrite the previous term and type B Cases. Then click on Save Term. Overwrite the previous term and type C Legislation. Then click on Save Term. Overwrite the previous term and type D Treaties. Then click on Save Term. Overwrite the previous term and type E Other. Then click on Save Term. Click Cancel, then click Close. Open a reference. To label your references, scroll down and click in the Label field. Use the shortcut Control-1 for PC or Command-1 for Mac and then double click on the label required. Closing your reference will save the change. Labeling your references means that the bibliography in your Word document will be automatically divided into sections with each section sorted alphabetically. EndNote doesn't add the headings, A articles, books, reports, etc. Just add these yourself manually. You have now set up the AGLC referencing style in EndNote. View the video key tips for using AGLC in EndNote to help learn the basics. If you need further assistance, please contact the library.